guys, it's Mr. Sophie and then I'm with Heartland Knight. And we have another little extra guest. We have Abu. Abu and Aladdin. How do you forget Aladdin? Oh, okay. Yes, I am. We have Aladdin as a guest because today's video is actually about the uh, Disney's live action Aladdin. We're doing a little combo type thing in this video. We're doing an uh, unboxing some Aladdin figures which is these in these little boxes these are new as far as I know unfortunately these are the cartoon version the animation yeah. not live action but it's still Aladdin so it fits in obviously the whole theme so we're gonna unbox some of these and once we've done that we thought it'd be interesting to share our thoughts and feelings on the actual live action film considering we've Seen it? Ah, we have. You've he's seen it once. I've seen it three times, so that's going to say a lot for me. And also a big shout out to this dude, because they were nice enough to buy me this Aladdin doll. So mm. we thought we'd have him as a little extra guest. So what we're going to do, like I said, we'll open this box, which clearly you don't already doing. So right, we didn't, you know, say we were doing it yet, but okay. Oh, getting them out. Oh, the getting all the hard, stupid plastic stuff off first. Ah. Fair enough. Also, with these boxes, we did buy, did we buy six? Yeah. We bought six, but we decided to save four for a video. Yeah. And open two, just for the fun of it, we open two, so, once he's took the horrifying wrapper off of this box, we will show you the ones that we've already opened. So these are the ones that are not opened. The ones that were opened. Are obviously opened. These two, which you can tell that they've been opened. And? What we got were one we got a boo. A boo. And then the other one what the um what <laughs> a boo. And then it was the um the king did. Yeah, and we've lost it with Bill on Aladdin's shoulder. <laughs> we are lost. Aladdin, he cannot be seen. They'll come back on camera, I promise. Also, this might be one warning to not have you on the channel anymore. Because you're too destructive. Thank you. Honestly, it makes a mess all the time. I don't. So, yes, the first two that we opened for fun, we got a bill. And, and we got the Sultan, yeah. not the King. It's the, king the Sultan. Dude. The King dude. Yeah, it's a King. The guy that the rules the, the. What's area. the place called? What's their home called? But no, no. So much for paying attention to the <laughs> film. Anyway, moving on. It's Acrobat. Yeah, I said that. Whatever. <laughs> Yes, yeah, so we got a bill and Sultan. If you guys want to know, show one of them the boxes on the back. The options are these. Aladdin, Jasmine, and Yeni. There's two versions Jabal. of Jasmine, two versions of Aladdin. The magic carpet, the pirate one, uh, the a guard, and some of those. The lion. Think that it all and some are rarer than others. I think the the, the rarest one is the magic carpet and the uh, whatever he is the disguised Jafar from the uh, ah, original yes. when they fooled Aladdin. Yes. So those two are the rarest. So in these other four boxes. I think we are at least obviously hoping for either Aladdin, Jasmine and Genie. I want Genie. 
the me the, the 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 magic. The magic carpet would be nice, but I don't see that happening. I'll be happy with genie, magic carpet, or lion. Raja. Tiger. Tiger here. Yeah. A Raja. I'm actually hoping that we don't get ones that I necessarily oh, the, don't want. Oh, like um, the palette. Like the disguised one, like disguised Jafar and the dodo narrates the being in and the card, like. We want the main ones, okay? We want the important ones. Ah, like so, many. let's actually shut up, shall we? And open the first box. Okay. The so, the like I said, Aladdin and Jasmine would be nice, but they're uh, one out of six. So they're supposed to be really common. Ah. Come in the blind bag, as usual. Okay. Yeah, you're, you're, you're up then. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. So the first one is. Please don't be repeat. Hey! Aladdin! Okay, that's it, my episode's done. Bye. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm kidding. We, we want more than Aladdin. We want Genie, don't we, guys? We want Genie. We do want Genie. There's so much that we really do want to say about the new film, but. But trying to save that for after the unboxing. Oh. Aladdin, you're a bit tipsy. Calm down. Calm down, lad. <laughs> it ain't good on this. Good. Not good on this feet. Uh, yeah, yeah we, we definitely want Gina. And we'll talk more about that after the unboxing. Do you want I wonder who this one would be. Do you want to grab a grab? Yeah, can I be a Let's move the bag. Okay. Oh, dips, dips, dips. <laughs> Hopefully not another repeat. I think that's another thing that we're hoping for. Mm. No repeats. Um, it's another repeat. How is it? It's another oh, Aladdin. It, another Aladdin. It's it, another Aladdin. There, one. Oh, for God's sake, we did leave them alone. We got two Aladdin. They're twins, in there. Twins. Twins. Twins and the Danny one. Oh god, that's horrifying. <laughs> okay. We place them down backwards and I'll do it again. Okay. Well, go. two Aladdins, so Jaden, if you're watching, one of the Aladdins is for you. Because I know you were eyeing the boxes up when you first saw them, so <laughs> I know what you were doing. Please don't be another Aladdin. Box number If we end up being another Aladdin, can't lose your head. Oh, thank you. So we'll see. Do you think this one's going to be the... Jamie. Good choice. What? Is it? N no, it's really thin. The magic wow. carpet. And that was... The rare one, that was one in 72 chance of getting this. Well, there's the title right there. We got the rarest one. Ah. We got the magic carpet. I'm a the one, one in 72. I never have this look with these boxes. No. Okay, I think this kind of mets up for the double Aladdin yeah. thing. But I'm happy, I'm not with, I'm happy with that. Nice! And then, for the year, open the And box. to say that the magic carpet doesn't talk, it's funny. It's a little bit, and it's a little bit back. I'll let you open it. How much do you want to bet that this is uh, another one of you? What, I like it. I like it. Although I don't think it is another Aladdin. Feeling it's another Sultan. Another Sultan. I think. I hope not. He ain't the best character, let's be honest. Oh, no, it isn't. Oh, it ain't. Who is it then? It's the. Uh, it's Prince Ali. 
I'll show you another Aladdin. There's another Aladdin, but do you want to show me that one? But it's... It's the Prince Ali version. It's a disguised version. Hello. <laughs> At the end of this video, I'm going to clobber him at the back of the head. There we go, Prince Ali. Look at that smolder. <laughs> yeah, it's so, well, actually three Aladdin's are both going to fall off. Yes, yeah, so, so we had two Aladdin, one Prince Ali, so in total three Aladdin's. Yeah. And then but obviously we did to get the we magic did, carpet out did of it. get the super rare one. Mm. So. Maybe. I'm pretty sure we would be up for it. And if you guys are up for it, maybe it's worth doing a part two yeah. for their landing boxes so we can at least get Genie. a Jasmine and a Genie. Because it'd still be nice to have them too. Yeah, it would. You know, they're part of the whole thing as well, so it's only fair to have those. Yep. So if you guys are interested, obviously give the video a like if you want to see part two and we'll try and get a lad in Jasmine and Jeannie! We, we don't want Aladdin. another Aladdin. Too much Aladdin. There are too many Aladdins. So, as we said, we did the unboxing. We got these figures and now we thought it would be interesting to have a little convo about the live action. What we think, how we felt, and you guys are more than welcome to comment below your thoughts if you have seen it. If you haven't already, which I would be very surprised. I want to watch now <laughs> and I'll wait until you're watching the film. <laughs> yeah. So if you haven't seen the film yet, stop. Then don't watch the rest of the video because there's going to be a lot of spoilers. Yeah. But if you have, then I'm pretty sure people would have seen it by now. But if you haven't, I can definitely say that we recommend it. Yes, we do. Because it was a very good film. It was more than good. There's so many words to describe. It was just How it fun. was. It was fun to watch. It were it was fun. And everything about it was just the thing is with the live actions is they it's not exactly the same as the original. They take things out from the original and add new stuff in. Yeah. For example, it's always been an extra song. Yeah. Which obviously this one is Jasmine's extra song. Yeah. And it's speechless, which I really did like that song. I've probably yeah. heard it a lot lately. Um, and the thing is, with the songs in the live action, I've enjoyed them a lot more. Because as I've tried explaining to, you, to Kyle, yeah. they have more power yeah. to them. Obviously with the originals, they're more smooth. But with this one, it actually makes you want to... It's more of an upbeat, you know, it more, you know, it louder and... It just Be brings that real, real life to life, yeah. doesn't it? That's the whole purpose. Uh, so I think as for the songs, we very much like the songs, especially you, because you like the one jump. So how was that for you? Yeah. That would be your favourite like one, I think. When they would go through the, you know, the town and trying to escape the guards. Yeah. Oh. Uh, so when I knew that when that come on, he would like it because that is his favourite. Is it your favourite now? I say it my favourite and then my shocking one if friends like me. Yeah, now that, <laughs> when Gina came into it, which Will Smith, the man is outstanding. Yeah. Is Gina outstanding. He did a and great job. He did. And all I can say is, all of the criticise that he got before the film was even out, all of that faded away. Yeah. All of it. The people that did criticise him came out and said, I take back what I said. Yeah. Because he played it so well. And it was so funny. I knew we were going to play it well. I anyway. did. I had 100% like, confidence that he would, he would have 
played that well, and he really did. It's one of the most obviously amazing reasons to watch it for. Yeah. The cameo between Genie and Aladdin is just... Funny. <laughs> very funny. So, the characters were great, the songs were great, and it just said more. There were more to this. We yeah. do have a bit of a downer. Some people might not feel the same way, um, but everyone that I've seen the film with has felt the same way. Unfortunately, that's down to Jafar. The person that did Jafar, he did play him well. He weren't good as Jafar. But my personal opinion, he wasn't the right person for Jafar. If you know the original version, when he has that villainy look, the deep voice, the yeah, he had none of that. He did it best, but obviously there are some films where they picked just the wrong actor to play it. But mm. he still did a good job. Did make the film worse or all like that? No, it was still just as good as we thought it was going to be. In fact, it was probably better than we thought it was going to be. But there's always going to be something in the films that are like, it was good, I enjoyed it a lot, but there's always, there's always something that you're not going to like. Yeah. But it's like you said, it weren't an, a bad enough choice for the fact it ruined the film. Yeah. It still played it right, I just kind of wish, maybe if they gave him a bit of a deeper voice, it wouldn't have been bad. If you had yeah. a deep voice, then you would have got away with it, but, Fuck. and I'm sorry, but Jafar, when you were laughing that film, my god, that's so fake. <laughs> the fakest laugh of this. That's really trying too hard. But there were many multiple funny things in the film as well that made us laugh. Yeah. Um, most of them are you know, that made uh, us laugh. Most of them. But it, when like Aladdin goes into the cave, cave um, um, when he he tell a boo to not be tempted to touch any of it, and then like five seconds later, Aladdin is tempted, and so like a boo basically goes. Just slaps him in the face, like, bitch now. <laughs> yeah, that one was, that one was quite funny, and then uh, moments that we have started actually kind of saying to each other just for laugh is with one of genies is when he's experimenting on how to look normal yeah. in the real world and he has his like ponytail thing um and aladdin says is that really necessary we always joke and say but that's my little child on top because <laughs> that's it was funny that it did make me laugh that and you were also like the bit where Junior realises he's in love with a girl <laughs> and he's on the floor with legs up like, who is she? Who is the girl? <laughs> yeah. There were quite a lot. Yeah. Is there any more you can and think of? And also, when, like, when, when he prints, you know, early, he, he goes into the, the throne room type thing and then, like, it's the Princess Jasmine said, are you trying to buy me? Yes, with the uh, golden wheel. Yeah. She says something like, it's an expensive wheel, and she says, um, so what do you plan to buy with this expensive wheel? And the lad then comes out with, you. you. No. no. <laughs> and Me. then she says, uh, didn't she say, are you suggesting I'm for sale? Of course. Of course. Not. No. And then Jane's just like, <laughs> embarrassing. And then we've got Aladdin with these uh, yam jams <laughs> and jams. tiny little spoons. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why we say little spoons, but there you go. <laughs> yes. And I did forget one part that actually made me laugh is the first time. The first ever time Aladdin gets caught by the guards and his voice breaks. You know when there's all of a sudden high pitch? Oh. And then there's like, mm-hmm, yeah. <laughs> Because his voice cracked. That was funny. Sounded like a little girl. 
<laughs> Sorry, Mina. <laughs> Peter did. <laughs> but no, everything about the film been loved and... It was fantastic. It was, I personally think I've loved all the live action so far, but for me, Aladdin has by far reached number one of the best live action so far. Mm. It's just... At, at first it was Beauty and the Beast, yeah. But at the moment I saw Aladdin, that went straight mm. up there. With live action, I watched them all except Cinderella. Mm. So I can't. Yeah, no, obviously. Really much. But like, mine is like, shit like, hard. Either Booty on the Beast or like Aladdin. they like, but I, I say that Aladdin dinner just went up a bit higher. Mm. But it were a hard choice. It were, it, but it's definitely reached up there in the yeah. um, in the top favourites. And from what I heard, it didn't take long to reach number one around the world. Mm. Hashtag mm -hmm. like number one film around the world. So congrats on that, because uh -huh. it definitely deserves that that spot. Um, and. It's good enough, obviously, that I've seen it three times. Yeah. Um, so, if you guys haven't seen it yet, we definitely <laughs> recommend it, because we'll guarantee that you'll laugh, at least at one point in the film. Yeah. You'll laugh. You'll love it. And it might have seemed like we haven't really said much about it, but there is so many good things to say about this film that this video would end up being like almost an hour long. Yeah. So we'll cut it short and sweet and just say everything that we have said and for the fact that it's amazing. Yeah. And go watch it. Yeah, yeah good live action. Definitely doing a good job with all the live yeah, action so they're far. Doing but really like well. me and you are both looking for well, to like the next one though, aren't we? Yeah, because the next one is the Lion King, yeah. which is next month. So it's not far fun. that. No. You might have to do well, another, you know, reaction to it after we've watched it. Yeah. I'm pretty sure we, will, we might end up doing that in a way. We'll probably yeah. do a video on thoughts and feelings towards the Lion King and maybe we'll try and find something a little bit more of a bonus to do in that video. Yeah. Like we have done with these figures. I'm pretty sure there might be some Lion King ones eventually. Yeah, probably, I'm So, guessing. if there is... I'll find those, but if not, I'm pretty sure we'll find something yeah. to do in the video we and then will. also share his feelings. So, we really hope that you guys have enjoyed today's video with the Aladdin unboxing and our thoughts and feelings towards the live action. We'll say it one last time, it's amazing. We definitely recommend that you watch it and ten let us ten. know in the comments what ten you think. Ten. Definitely. <laughs> definitely. So thank you so much for watching and we will probably see you next time for The Lion King. See you guys. Bye. Bye.